And a woman who held a babe against her bosom said, Speak to us of children. And he said, Your children are not your children. They are the sons and daughters of life's longing for itself. They come through you, but not from you. And though they are with you, yet they belong not to you. You may give them your love, but not your thoughts, for they have their own thoughts. You may house their bodies, but not their souls, for their souls dwell in the house of tomorrow, which you cannot visit, not even in your dreams. You may strive to be like them, but seek not to make them like you. For life goes not backwards nor tarries with yesterday You are the bows from which your children as living arrows are sent forth The archer sees the mark upon the path of the infinite And he bends you with his might that his arrows may go swift and far Let your bending in the archer's hand be for gladness For even as he loves the arrow that flies So he loves also the bow that is stable The bow that is stable Could I possibly say after your gospel of pages Some may mock me as crazy to put my thoughts on display For you to watch them, but nay, what I sought this day With these sayings was to express how our progeny's progress is logarithmic Next to exponential, non-sequential to our own Yet it draws upon it densely and intensely They have our facets within them, astrally and mentally But our pasts and sentience do not entrap them Rather they hem them to navigate through the traps in our kingdoms If we are kings for the time being, our sons and daughters are akin to divine beings. They chime gleaning, centered in mind beams, psycho and pyrokinetic. They sire prophetic tapestries, majestic masterpieces. Past the thesis we wrought, they complete us like thought with a Coptic priestess. Our optics deceive us, for they are not what we see. They are not but impossibly gifted, yet not with our afflictions. They aren't caught in betwixt them. They transcend all our capacities, like strands hemmed from a galaxy yet to be discovered. Celestial brothers and sisters at each other's assistance Coveted mystics, yet if we corrupt our imprints upon them They become cussing misfits and pawns listless in the dawn's distance Cons and statistics, silly and aimless Pillaging villages nameless when they were meant to be Indigo children of seventh density Wendigo killers and tamers, it's elementary But we're still in the matrix, back in your days and times There were amazing changes You saw the rise of the Baha'i faith like skyscrapers now they annihilate the sky with vapors toxic Flavors nauseous in our foods Toxins in the jewels were fed By fools bred to rule with dead and nuisance Hoof prints in Amazonian soil Where there used to be only the spoils of nature Royal capers and killings So I pray for the healing Pray for our children Wait for the revealing of their fates Yet I know them to be bold and great Like olden patrons Glowing like oasis visions To a parched wanderer in the desert Yet this is no illusion Stop and ponder the immeasurable worth of these golden blueprints To our soul's true sense Yet the globe is gruesome But they can change it They can paint the canvas of their age Any which way they please With yantras amazing displayed with ease The banters are fading as they play in the weeds We watch them grow like crops in the glowing sun The frost and the cold The droughts will only stop them for a moment For they will know they are one With the omens we've spun And thus as we behold them We've begun our atonement And thus as we behold them We've begun our atonement